This is Nancy from Jungle Pixie Belize and today I'm going to show you how I make those really cool closures on my Game of Thrones style uh, Rosewood Burl carving series. Um, this is a great closure because there's no metal involved in it. Um, I bet many of you have experienced the same thing as me. You get a really cool necklace that you like that depends on some spring ring and jump ring mechanism and closure and the next thing you know it's gone. Um, the other nice thing about this is it's completely organic so there's there, there, there's no metal closure involved at all so I'm going to show you how I make that and how adjustable it is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with these two pieces of cord and I'm going to just use two ceramic beads that's what I have handy right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pass the cord through this bead and then I'm going to go ahead and pass it through the second bead. So you've got two beads on this cord and I'm going to turn it around because I'm very very right handed and then I'm going to take this cord from the opposite direction and I'm going to pass it through the first bead and then I'm going to pass it through the second bead. Now one of the key issues that you have to realize on this is that the holes in the beads have to be the right size to allow two pieces of cord, but not so much as they're going to um, be too loose and then they, they won't hold the adjustment either. So what we've got here is it passes through both beads both directions and there it is. There's your, that would be long. You're going to be wearing it long and if you're going to be wearing it short you're pulling on the cord, not the beads, and then you've got your long adjustment like that. So again, to make it sh to make it longer, make the, the necklace longer, you're going to pull it, and to make it shorter, you're going to pull it this way to get your short adjustment. So again, on this main piece. This piece is called um, Dothraki Sun Chaser and right now it's a choker. If I pull this from either side I can make it long enough to be a chest piece and this is also nice because it can be for guys too. Um, and then to make it shorter, we pull on the knots, then we pull on the beads, you get it to exactly where you want it. In this case, I'll put it all the way short again, hang it on my little model neck here. And there you have it. So that's about it. Thank you again for stopping in. I'm Nancy from Jungle Pixie Belize and we'll see you next time.